Got anything to say? I thought I was a goner there. Thanks for the help. What a strange dream. It almost felt familiar somehow. Who knows? Who knows? All right, Mr. Mayor. Please don't send me. I'm gonna save the game first. I don't want to like make a wrong decision that be sent back to the previous save. Oh God! Looking at something so bright is hurting my eyes now. Ah! <clears throat> All right. Hello, sir. Oh, how wonderful! Thank you so much. No problem. Here, I have something for you. Ooh. Obtain the one-handed sword, Faith. Wow, Ooh. this looks valuable. I can really have it? Of course. Cool. It's apparently a weapon of some renown, but we have little use for it. Well, we appreciate it. Certainly. Thank you again for everything. <sighs> well, that's, that's, that's that out of the way. Let's look at... Oh, you're right. Earthworm Claw. Few details. Ugly weapon. Now, Beast Vein Faith. It does. It's it's still worse than Beast Vein, but it's very fast. Whoa, that's just a straight up katana. A sword carried by the world's most loyal servant. Like that loyalty, the war the sword's blade is straight and true. I can upgrade it! I think I might start wielding faith if I could like upgrade it. <clears throat> More reading. There was once a famous poet in a land to the far, far east. Now in his twilight years, his ability had withered such that he could no longer craft a single stanza or verse. The poor poet spent every moment racked with sorrow for what had been lost. But one day, a monk appeared by his side, gently placed a blade in his hand, and imparted the following words. Well, I can't read the words until I... Get the upgrade. Yeah, alright. Is that all? Is that everything here? Because if so, I'm gonna go to the, uh... Gonna go see if any more side quests have unlocked. That seems like it's everything. I'm gonna go to the, uh, upgrade shop. Upgrade Faith. <clears throat> I'm gonna go and upgrade Faith, and I'm gonna... Uh, see what I can do. Big sip of water, because my voice feels like it is going. So, how was the village? <coughs> Awful. <coughs> oh, it was truly magnificent. There are no words. Really. Huh. Neat. Let's get back to Popola. She'll probably want to know what's going on in there. <sighs> it feels like there's, like, something caught in my throat. Oh, well, I'll deal with it. I'll deal with it later. But first... Kind A will be fine. Uh, ah, I should've. Whoa! We like did a team attack right there. Well, good luck, Kane. Yeah. To the brothers! Actually, I want to test out my new of magic. much harder to hit people with it. Oh well, I'll upgrade it anyway. Wow, look at this dynamic camera angle. <laughs> medicinal herb, because I know this place has thousands of them. Yep. I guess there's really nothing stopping me from just like 
So like farm money, going back to this place and just getting like a whole bunch of medicinal herbs. There's a lot of medicinal herbs here. I don't know. I think there's much easier ways though. It's just a, a way. How did you guys enjoy a uh, story time? <clears throat> I had fun. I don't think I've gotten like I had I've had to read that much in a while. Well, no, not in a while. I I, I enjoy reading on my own time, but like on on camera, you know what I mean. What's up? How can I help you? Sword. Need some work done on your weapon? Yes, forging. Can't upgrade any others. I'm trying to see, like, currently it, it does 147, and it goes up to 189. Like, what other weapons upgrade that nicely? The only weapon that, like, does more damage is Beast Bane. Eh. Why not? Ooh, does it, like, does it have a new design on it? I can upgrade it again? All I need is, is all my silver ore, all my elaborate machines, and all of my natural rubber. If I do this, this is essentially like confirming that Faith is the only sword I will be using. Which I'm fine with, actually. <clears throat> well, for a while, at least. It officially makes it do more damage than Beastbane. So I'm no longer, like, settling. Now what do I need? More silver ore, moldavite, and titanium alloy. Eesh. Well, I'm fine with my upgrade. Now we have a lot more reading to do. Come back soon. You come back soon. A little bit more reading to do. I remember it being like a lot more rusty before. Let's read it. Gently placed a blade in his hands and imparted the following words. Kill one by this blade for one poem, and two for two in kind, the likes of which will be more splendid than any this world has ever heard. Clinging to the monk's words, the man waited for cover for the cover of darkness and cut down a man he encountered by the roadside. The following day, he wrote a most beautiful poem instantly reclaiming the fame and prosperity he had lost. The poet went on to kill two in succession. He killed one and wrote a poem, then killed again and wrote another, rising to almost dazzling levels of wealth and renown. But soon he be became obsessed with knowing how splendid a poem he might write if he were to kill someone precious to him. Jeez, kids, you mind lightening up a little? All right, let's head, to, let's head to Popola, or whoever whoever wants to talk to me. Devla first, I think, to see if she has any more quests for us. <sighs> Tomorrow I'm going to need to record some more Disco Elysium. It's even more reading. I guess I guess all of my all of my let's plays require. Oh, what what reading boils down to me is or what boils down to is just me talking while well, reading text obviously but you know so I guess I guess it is really I'm just me complaining about having to talk too much which is a stupid complaint to have when I am a let's player it's weird to think about myself as a let's player I'm finally like a content creator instead of just you know Let's test it out! Let's test it out! Faith! Oh my god! Ugh. Yeah, okay, Faith is pretty strong. I'm glad I upgraded this thing. Faith will surely provide a lot of use in the future. Sorry. Whoa, that guy went flying. So did I. Just get him out the front of the village. 
Yeah. I'm gonna head over to Devil to see if she has any new quests for me. Wait, actually, let me check the quest log. Still 49%. I guess those other ones weren't like official quests. It's finally good to have, like, a weapon that, like, doesn't look, like, as bad as Beast Bane does. You know what I mean? Have any new quests? Hmm. What have we got today? Doesn't look like I have any work for you right now. Come back next time you're free, okay? Cool. Just checking out. Just checking. Maybe, maybe more quests will pop up after I talk to Popola. All right. Weiss, what are you doing? Weiss just like spinning around and opening up his pages while I'm running around. Blah, blah, I read too much, and now my voice hurts. Hey. The death dream certainly is a strange <clears throat> illness. Oh, yeah. Yeah, it was something, all right. Even I, with my natural love for words, have no desire to visit that place ever again. Knowing our luck, this next set of Pope quests from Devil is going to send us right there. You guys did well. Thank you. You've been making a lot of long trips lately. Are you sure you're not pushing yourself too hard? We need to save Yona. I'm okay. I can't just sit around all day while Yona's sick, after all. Exactly. If you say so. So, anything I can do for you? Well, I suppose there is one thing I could use a hand with. Have you heard about our plans to repair the canal? No. The work probably won't happen for a while. But once it's done, we can use the canal for trade and travel and all kinds of useful things. Mm. Unfortunately, however, we're a bit behind schedule at the moment. If you're willing to help out, I'd really appreciate it. What do no I need problem. to do? What do you need? Great. So, the man I originally asked to help on this project hasn't shown up for work in a few days. I'm mm -hmm. starting to get a little worried, so maybe you can head over to Seafront and check up on him? I'll Seafront. mark the location of his house on your map. He always carries a red bag over his shoulder, so he should be easy enough to find. On it. Got it. And now I'll go talk to Devil and see if there's any more quests. Hi, Yona. A canal, is it? Fascinating. If we had a ferry, we could put these days of endlessly running about behind us. Yes. Don't you just float everywhere anyway? Do you think I am borne aloft by the winds, lad? It takes stamina to maintain this height. Oh, really? I didn't know that. You could at least try to hide the utter dismay, you know. Devla! Doesn't look all right, all right. Do I finally have enough time for myself so that I could actually just like start like beelining the main quest? Wow. I'm gonna get there and I'm just gonna be like, by the way, we need to capture us 10 whales. Ugh. Seafront. Red bag over shoulder. Yeah, the guy is gone. Interesting. Bonk. What was that? 
Oh, it's just a. Ow! Why? What are you doing? That deer had like a. Ugh. I, uh. My dad is texting me. Hold on. Uh, he's asking me what I want from restaurant. Unprofessional, but I don't care. There we go. All right, back at it. Right, right, right. I I stopped. I st I got off of Royal because I thought this was like a pile of goo, and I thought somebody had been like just disintegrated. And, uh, yeah. Alright, red bag. Oh, I can see it right on the map. That, that takes out any guessing, huh? Hey, man. I like your bag. Um, hey, uh, are you the guy who's supposed to help repair the canal? Popola sent me to... That's a really nice bag. Oh god, it's over. My life is over! What? Surely you must realize nothing good can come of being involved with this particular endeavor. Easy, Vice. Hey, so, are you alright? It's my uh, wife. She left home a week ago and hasn't come back. I accidentally skipped over words. I'm so worried I can't even focus on my work. Oh, my sweet darling, oh. where are you? Wow, that's terrible. Would you like us to help you look for her? Really? You do that for me? Yeah. Sure. Er, but do you have any idea where we should start? Hmm. Well, she always used to enjoy drinking at the tavern with her friends. All right, then I guess we'll start with them. Thank you. This means the world to me. Oh, and by the way, my wife always carries a red bag, just like mine. If you mention that, it might ring some bells. All right. I've met some odd couples in my day, but none who felt the need to wander about flaunting matching luggage. <laughs> you need to get with the times. Coordinated outfits are all the rage. Plus, these bags are special. We bought them for our anniversary. But oh. now my sweet dumpling is gone. <laughs> and it's all my fault. Okay, okay. Just work. stay calm. We'll go look for her, all right? You sit tight. I do not remember this part of the quest from the original Nier. I'm willing to bet that man knows more about his wife absconding than he's letting on. Well, one way to find out. By talking to people. You. Hey there, I'm, uh, looking for a woman carrying a red bag. Are you now? Yeah. Interesting. Did something happen to her? She We're hasn't been home and her husband's worried. Do you know anything about where she might be? <laughs> Trouble in paradise, is it? Oh, those two never change. Anyway, the short answer is no. Yeah. She hasn't been around here either. Though come to think of it, she always got on well with the woman over at the tackle shop. Maybe you should try her? I'll do that. Here we go. Thanks. Hey, what's the rush? You've got a cute face. Why not sit here and join me for a round? Or three? Uh, uh, sorry, ma'am, but I'm not old enough to drink. Man, still having drinking laws in the apocalypse. Well, tackle shop. You. Hey there. Weird Do you know hair. a woman with a red bag by any chance? A red bag? Oh, sure. Although now that I think about it, I haven't seen her in a while. Nobody Last has. Last time she came around, she mentioned something about leaving town. But I figured it was just idle talk. Mm -hmm. Leaving town, huh? All right, thanks for your time. If she has truly <sighs> left this charming hamlet, finding her may prove most difficult indeed. I just hope she hasn't been attacked by shades or anything. We'll, we'll find her. We'll find her. 
I have no idea what this quest is. Is all these all the quests I've done before? I've like, I think this is like new to this. This. If I'm wrong, then tell me in the comments. But I'm pretty sure this is like this remake ex exclusive red bag. I hate the way it moves. Can I do this? I can. It doesn't look like she's over there. What? Uh. Let's let's just walk. Let's just walk. I'll check. I'll check in there later. What is that? Oh, it's just a poison attack, I guess. A red bag. Oh. Hmm. Something about that shade seems rather odd. What about it? Oh. Hey, look at this. It is identical to the red satchel carried by the man who sent us on this mad quest. Perhaps it belongs to his spouse. Oh no. Do you think the Shades got her? I fear it likely, lad. I sense no other activity in the immediate vicinity. We were too late. Well, this is terrible. What are we supposed to say? The truth. However difficult it may be, we've no choice but to tell the man the truth. Right outside of town as well. Like, when did that happen? It must have. Hmm. Unfortunate. Unfortunate. So did. Hmm. I guess we'll find out. some good news and some bad news good news is I uh, have another bag for you the bad news is uh yeah hey did you find my sweet dumpling we didn't but we got this off a of shade here you go man oh, no this this is hers so our fears were correct oh god how could this happen to her? Why did she leave? <laughs> and this is all my fault. Is it? I mean, we I want to find out. Let's ask him. If I may, my good man, why did your wife leave home in the first place? <laughs> it's because... Because I... I think we should give him some time to himself, Vice. Uh, hello. Oh. You're not dead. What in the world are you talking about? Oh. oh. Oh, you found my bag. Thank you so much. I can't believe I went and dropped it like that. Oh, okay, cool. Ha happy oh, ending. This is such a relief. <sighs> okay, seriously. What's going on? Why is everything black? Don't you dare pop up more words. I guess it's, uh, those words are fine. I see. So, he found a shade with my bag and assumed I'd been attacked and killed? Yeah. I'm just glad you're safe, Dumpling. But I'm also so sorry. This is all my fault. Oh, if I didn't eat that apple you were saving. Oh, God, I'm such an idiot. Listen, I promise I'll never eat anything of yours again. <laughs> you just promise never to run away from home again, okay? You know what, at least he's... Sympathetic? 
I'm not quite sure what the word is here, but he seems like a good dude if overly self-critical. Run away? Have you lost your mind? I just went to visit my parents. Huh? Uh. I told you about this. Going to see my family, gone for a week, <laughs> remember? Ugh, are you serious right now? Why don't you ever listen to me? Um... I'm just... Lad, my brilliant intuition suggests we should beat a hasty retreat from these two with all speed. You know what, Vice? Oh, I could stick around, though? Ah, oh, fuck it, let's stick around. I can't believe you didn't listen to me, and you ate my apple. Ugh, you are the absolute worst! What?! Oh, like you're some perfect angel. You didn't even care enough about our anniversary to hang onto your bag. You, kid, I'm uh, right about this, yeah? If anyone's wrong here, it's my wife, right? I didn't sign up for this. Wait, you're asking me? Uh, why? I mean... I, I, I think the wife is in the wrong here. All dude did was eat an apple and not listen? Well, listen, an lady. anniversary gift is an important thing. You probably should have taken better care of it. Yeah. Oh, so I'm the bad guy now. Hmm? Duh. Is this fun for you two? Do you like ganging up on a poor innocent woman? Ooh, you disgust me. What is happening? What? No, that's not what I meant. Am I wrong? Besides, it's pretty rich to come after me for an apple when you threw away my entire stamp collection. <gasps> His entire stamp collection? Ha, you're damn right I did, and I'd do it again. You are nothing but a hoarding slob. You there, my husband's in the wrong here, isn't he? No. Uh, pardon, but madam, I... I, no, I think it's still. I still think it's you, lady. Like, having a collection is not hoarding. I, I, I guess it depends on how many stamps. But still. Uh, well, uh, to discard a man's precious hobby is a rather heinous act. Oh, <laughs> yeah, of course you to take his side. Figures. You'd fit right in with his pile of collectible trash. Did his postage collection also fly and talk and chew magic? Collectible trash? Now see here! Why am I still here? <laughs> Do you not even understand how frustrating this is, you colossal oaf? This is exactly what I hate about you! Fine, hate me! I'll still sleep like a baby knowing I'm not an unreasonable hag like you! Vice, what do I do? Just leave. You turn on your heel and walk away as fast as your legs can carry you, my good lad. That's, that's the correct thing to do, but if given the option to stay here, I will. That's it! I have had enough! Instead of belittling me, why don't you get a proper job? Everyone in the neighborhood treats me like dirt, and it's all because of my unemployed slob of a husband. Isn't he trying to help us build this canal? Uh, actually, I have a job now. Wait, you what? Yeah. You're kidding. Why didn't you tell me? <laughs> That's great! Well, I sort of wanted it to be <laughs> a surprise. Oh, you big silly Billy. Well, this calls for a celebration. Come on, I'm I... going to bake you a nice apple pie. This is definitely new to the remake. Cool. Glad to help? I have no idea what just transpired, Same. but it has utterly exhausted me. That was more exhausting than the words. Well, looks like they made up, so all's well that ends well? I'm gonna find one of their corpses later, aren't I? In the course of all that madness, I have forgotten why we even came here in the first place. Oh, heck, the canal! We need to ask him about the canal! Buddy. Canal. I can't thank you enough for all your help. 
No problem. I'll. I'll. No, I'll be here. I'll. Be... Uh, sure. Yeah. But listen, we need to talk to you about the canal. All right. That's why you came here in the first place, huh? Yeah. Well, now that my love life is rolling in clover again, I'd be more than happy to get going on the canal work. Cool. I guess we can head back now. Thanks. That was exhausting. Tell me about it. Anyway, let's go give Popola an update. <sighs> I just... I just hope that they have spent the rest of their lives happily. Kaine, you... You... The couple with the red bags were a you. strange pair indeed. It boggles the mind to think their relationship can persist despite such intense squabbling. Guess he's back. Well, they looked pretty happy in the end, at least. Maybe the secret to living a happy life is sharing your feelings, even when they're sort of mean and weird. I mean, yeah, that's seems correct. If you adopt such a strategy, I may leave for groceries one day and never return. Hey, guy. I mean, yeah, it's a, it's a good idea to communicate with your partner. Not a good idea to shout at them and call them a useless slob or throw out their postage stamp collection. What a uh, whatever. If if they're happy, then or if they never talk to me again, then I'm happy. What they do, what they do now is up to them. And I uh, this is probably the end of the episode. This time, I'm gonna make sure I save the game. Because I'm gonna... I'm gonna bring you along with me to make sure that I save this game. I was thinking about saving in a... place over there. Seafront. But then I kind of forgot. Look, saving the game. The game has been saved. Now I can leave. Goodbye.